Hey all you cool cats and fun felines, it's Leah and Lynn. And today we're in Jonesboro, Arkansas at our house. And we just wanted to talk about the Lansky brothers and Elvis's relationship today. So Lynn, what are we gonna do? Get into the groove. That's right. So one day Bernard Lansky was looking out at his window and he saw someone you know, window shopping, a young man doing some window shopping. A good looking young man. Yeah, I'm sure he was. <laughs> so he thought he would be nice. You know, this is the South. I want to go out there and introduce myself to this man and bring him in. So he brought him in. He said, I, I want to, you know, come on in. I'll show you around. The guy, the, the young man said, I'm sorry, sir, but um, I, I don't have any money. But one day I'm going to come in here and buy you out. And Mr. Lansky said, well, you don't have to buy me out. Just buy from me. That's so right. So that started a relationship that lasted all the way up until uh, 77, and I guess, until Elvis' was passing. And but, the young man was Elvis Presley. And they started the pink and black, like, style in the 50s. And the first time anybody saw Elvis wearing Lansky Brothers was in 1956 on the Ed Sullivan Show, the first time he performed and everybody thought I mean he was the sharpest dressed man he's Elvis he yeah he's the knew. king yeah, totally no one had to say hey man you look good he was like oh thank you thank you very much uh, <laughs> I yeah and I mean Elvis and Bernard's relationship lasted like Lynn said until Elvis's death in 77 of course Bernard died in 2012 but he also made you know uh, lots of other uh, famous musicians from Memphis shop there you know with the bb king and roy orbison even um duke and, ellington yeah. yeah i mean like everybody that went through Isaac Memphis Hayes. wanted to shop at lansky brothers and the reason why we're talking about this today well, is yeah. one because i mean elvis yeah. is our guy and we know you want to hear about it and two last week was my birthday and i actually got a Lansky's Brothers jacket. And not just any Lansky Brother jacket. He got the replica of Elvis's wedding jacket. And sure. he looks sharp. So we want to show you. Go grab Without it. Without further ado. Uh -huh. He's going to go get it. Uh -huh. First of all, the presentation. Ooh. Unzip. Mm. Ooh. Turn around and show it all. Oh, Lynn. It is extra soft and extra silky. And it has a little nice paisley pattern. Yes. And look at the inside. Ooh, Elvis and Bernard all over. And even the pocket square. Oh, it has the little logo. Brothers. Yes. Clother to the king. And Man. his little pocket square. It's the same. It has Elvis. But, but look how right, sharp Lynn looks in it. A black, a black, solid black shirt on under here. I like it. I think it did a very really good job. Spin for me. Turn around. Yeah. I don't want to knock that over. <laughs> yes, oh, yeah. Lynn. Awesome. Digging the jacket. I mean, oh, yeah, you look sharp. Lynn's one one for a long time. Well, I have. And this is the first we, one. I was one of those young men window shopping in there, but I didn't say, one day I want to come in here and buy you out. I said, one day I want to come here and get one of these jackets. <laughs> Finally, three years later, did it? No, two years later. <laughs> so we know this is a short vlog, but we just really wanted to show off Lynn's jacket because I I'm mean, going to get a chance to wear it for a little while. And, yeah. You know. I mean, dig it. I'm surprised he's not wearing it every day. Actually, well, <laughs> I don't want to wear it. People would be like, "Why are you wearing that to Walmart?" I mean, well, why not? Would you wear it to Walmart? I don't know. Let me know if you would. If you would. Yeah, I let us know if you would wear this jacket to Walmart. Change my mind. Let us know. <laughs> so, hey, 
Um, thank you so much again for getting us to 10,000 subscribers. We're now at 10.5. That's awesome. You sky's the up. limit. Thank you, guys. thank you guys so much. This is yeah, it's mind blowing. It is. It's mind blowing. It's been it's been 10 months and we've gotten to 10,000. So thank it's all because so of you. And we're gonna have more content coming out next weekend. We have a really cool one coming out next weekend. So Actually, yeah. make make sure you stay tuned and. For now, stay groovy.